in this video we are going to derive the formula of first principle of differentiation let's take one function Let y equal to fx is a function and f dash x is known as derivative of fx basically and f dash x is change in y with respect to x if we increase the value of x or decrease the value of x the value of y will also be increased or decreased if we increase the value of x by h the value of y also be increased by h we can understand it with the help of graph this is point x and fx and if we increase the value of x by h then this point will be x plus h let it be p and this is q at point p the value of x will be x plus h and the value of y will be x plus h it means the value of function will also be increased by h then slope of this line slope of qp equal to change in x this is change in x and this is change in y then slope of qp is delta y upon delta x and delta y is equal to change in y and delta x is change in x from this graph we are going to put the value of delta y and delta x then it will be f x plus h minus fx upon x plus h minus x x and minus x got cancelled if this point p get closer to point q but not exactly at q we have to find limit for that we have to put h approaches to zero put limit h approaches to zero f x plus h minus fx upon h when we take limit if this limit exists then only it is differentiable dy by dx and f dash x is called derivative with respect to x this formula to find any derivative is called first principle we can find derivative of all the function with the help of this formula let's take one question find the derivative of fx equal to x square now we have to find dy by dx or f dash x by the formula of first principle that is limit h tends to 0 f x plus h minus fx upon h we have fx equal to x square if we increase x by h then we have to put x plus h whole square we have to put these values in this formula limit x tends to 0 x plus h whole square minus x square upon h limit h tends to 0 solve it x square plus h square plus 2 x h minus x square upon h 
x square cancelled with negative x square is cancelled with positive x square and limit h tends to 0 we have to take h common from h square plus 2 x h h into h plus 2 x upon h h is cancelled by h now put the value of h equal to 0 which is equal to 2x answer is 2x finally derivative of x square is equal to 2x thank you for watching my videos